on Sunday, September 24th, a quarter to 3 p.m., you will witness a story never before told. The concept behind this session is to kind of look into the crystal ball and try to forecast what's going to be the future of transplantation. Welcome to Big Bang in Transplantation, featuring Carol Lamarck, speaking about her experiences as a transplant recipient. Robert H. Henning, showing how new organ preservation drugs have been developed based on hibernation mechanisms found in nature. The real question is, can we exploit the secrets of hibernation for medicine? And I believe we can. Gerald Brandacher, presenting a glimpse into the near future of transplantation. Reconstructive transplantation, such as hand, extremity or face transplantation, is today the only option to fully restore missing limbs, faces or other body parts by replacing like with like tissue. Our research team is developing novel strategies to minimize or avoid the need for immunosuppressive drugs. We found ways to use stem cells or immune cells from donors to perform hand and face transplantation with minimal levels of immunosuppression for the first time. And John E. Bradford, providing a look into the far future, including the human fate from a universal perspective. Significant mass savings with just switching to the TPN and then we get additional reductions in uh, requirements when we go to the metabol lower metabolic states stuff. So we're down to about 300 grams uh, per person per day. Uh, for reference, on the space station, the average is about 2,000 grams uh, per day. Don't miss Big Bang in Transplantation at the 2017 Congress. So you have no good reason not to be present in Barcelona, so we're all waiting you.